if you have a love for painting or reading or both, or maybe you want to unlock the artist inside of you that you kept at bay for some reason, artist and author Jenny Hahn can really help you tap into your creative side. And this morning she's helping us tap into ours with a mini painting workshop. Good morning, Jenny. Good morning. Thank you so much for having me on and for Thank being you. willing to yeah. Yes. Yes. play. Yeah. Well, I... First, we have some questions. The first one being, what are we going to be painting this yeah. morning? That is a mystery, isn't okay. it? Okay, <laughs> I like it. We will find out, yes. Um, yeah, tapping our creativity is really about coming home to ourself and our creative potential. And it's about trusting the process and not needing to plan ahead what's going to happen, but being open to whimsy, to discovery. And it's, it's a journey. It's yeah. a journey that unfolds step by step. I, I really, really love it. where you're coming from, Jenny. Yeah. This we were just br talking briefly before we went on the air, but you know how I'll, I'll, you know even you, you don't think, oh, I'm I'm terrible. I can't draw stick figures, but but your whole message I'm gathering is sort of um, trust yourself. Just try something. Just who knows? Have fun. Absolutely. Like it might heal your soul. It might be crap, but you might feel great <laughs> afterwards, right? <laughs> crap is just a, a judgment of the mind, right? Yeah. It's really, yeah, we all are creative beings. We're all worthy of expression. And it's going to show up differently for each of us. Some of us might be drawn to paint. Some might be drawn to use our voice, to uh, make music, to bake, to start a business. There's so many ways that our creativity wishes to express in the world. Sure. And so when we can learn to let it flow and not block it, it's amazing what can happen, what can show up. Wow. Okay, let's try it. Let's give it a shot. You ready? Yes. Yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. okay, great. So we have a couple of setups here. Okay. And I invite you to just, uh, you can each kind of stand in front of your easel. All right. Okay. And I invite you to just start by tuning in. So taking a breath. Okay. Feeling your feet on the floor. And then just beginning to turn on to what color are you drawn to in this moment? So you've already got some paint set up in front of you. You can give your brush a little drink of water if you wish. Oh, and just, and it's all right. Okay. Just dip right into the color. Okay. And inviting play, beginning to just make marks on the page. I often refer to this as sort of a brush dance. So how does the brush want to move on the page? Staying tuned into your breath, to your body. How does your body want to move right now in this moment? Yeah. Do you feel like making small strokes? Do you feel like making large strokes? Is there Are there shapes that are showing up? So yeah. inviting that play and trusting the process. I'm just following my spirit here. Following your spirit, Pat. Yes. You got it. Yes, yes. Where it's going to go. So there's no right or wrong. There's no mistakes. We're just allowing our inner child to show up and to play, to explore, and to follow the thread moment to moment, seeing what wants to happen next. Okay. Yeah, great. Staying with your breath, staying with your body. And so your book, you have a book that talks about all this stuff, right? I do. My book, Creative Flow, Tap and Express Your Juicy Essence. It's all about coming home to yourself, to your creative potential. And it doesn't have to be through paint. Like I said, I've, it's, the book is filled with writing prompts, with creative expression activities using basic art materials, uh, mindfulness practices. Uh, it's just really meant to be a tool to support you and, yeah, to, to support your creative unfolding. Well, before we look at, could you want to talk about, do real quick? I don't your, really your, know. I yeah. like purple. I like pink. And yes. then I just started going with sort of a, I liked the bright yellow because I, we, we had a beautiful sunset for our family photos last night. So I was like, oh, I should do some yellow. Yeah. So I don't know. I think I was thinking yeah. sunshine, sunset sort of look. How about you? I, it's weird. I started that way too. I started with a sun and then, yeah, okay. uh, yes. and then for some reason I drew a pink wall. I like it. I don't know why. <laughs> why is some rain? Is that rain? And I guess it's rain, rain or maybe it's people. Okay. I don't know. You, yeah. know, just, you know, just unlocking my unconscious I on really, live TV. I really so, so how does it feel? How are you feeling, you know, from just, yeah, allowing yeah, your inner child? I, I do feel good. I feel a little yeah. judged by the people who are laughing <laughs> in my eye. <laughs> but otherwise, so, so that's a great Look, it doesn't look so easy, okay? <laughs> that, that is a great 
part, that's a great, I'm glad you mentioned that, Abby, because our inner critic can show up yeah. when we get vulnerable, when we show up in this way. Yes. And so this is why we have these tools to work through that. And I go through this in my book of how to disarm the inner critic, yeah. how to let go of those inner judgments that we've been taught, yes. that we're raised with, and our fear of comparison, all these things, and really to let all that go and to come back to our own center. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Yeah. That, it's really cool. It, it is. It was kind of nice. I did kind of get lost in a little bit. Jenny, thank you for joining us. Yes, thank Hello. you so much. And so people can find your book yes. uh, pretty much anywhere, Jenny? So, so it like... just launched today on creativeflowbook.com. Oh. Also this Saturday, I'm going to be having my uh, author event and book signing at Center for Spiritual Living uh, and the Nat Natasha Ria Gallery. They're at 1014 West 39th Street in Kansas City. Nice. It's from 6 to 730 this Saturday. Free event. Um, you can cool. RSVP online. Awesome. Good yeah. stuff. Creative flow. Jenny Han, thanks for coming by. Thank, thank you, you, Pat and Abby. Thank you for your courage. Absolutely. Oh, for playing. Yes. Thanks. All right, well, from that to this.